What's up YouTube, Jeff back again. Today, a very exciting Samsung video for you guys. It is the day that a lot of you have been waiting for. Samsung One UI 6.0 is rolling out in the United States. The international release happened uh, about two weeks ago almost now, um, but now it is rolling out in the US as well. Before we get started and talk about the new build numbers and everything, I wanna remind you guys if you're gonna be ordering a Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, S24 Ultra, Go to my website if you're here in the United States and sign up for a mystery box from us. You get a free case, cleaning kit, desktop phone stand, other goodies as well. We insert Amazon gift cards and Google Play gift cards, one in every 10 boxes as well. Put your first name, last name, email. No purchase necessary for you. You don't have to pay shipping. We cover all that. All you have to do is use our affiliate link to place your Samsung order that you're already going to buy on Samsung.com for the pre-order. And uh, then we ship these out shortly after release. So check that out. Pin comment description, we've been doing it for all the different launches the last few years. You can see, really love doing this for the community. Anyway, I have two S23 Ultras here because one of these has the One UI 6.0 stable update and one of them is still running the beta. And uh, you probably could guess, this on the right here is my wife's S23 Ultra, which is on T-Mobile. This one's actually bought through T-Mobile. Um, it's not a locked, uh, unlocked phone. Um, and today, this morning, she received the, uh, I don't know why I'm checking for software update. She received the One UI 6.0 stable update. There it is. One UI 6.0 version ending in BWK4, November 1st security patch. I had told you guys before that Samsung was working on a bunch of new builds for One UI 6.0. And uh, they were going to roll that out to the US. So this is actually a little bit newer than I think what they got around the rest of the world. Uh, are there any crazy new changes? Not really. Uh, if you're on T-Mobile, T-Mobile now has a verified business call feature. Uh, when available, it shows the verified call information from trusted businesses and the reason for their call. So that's a cool feature, I guess, if you have a T-Mobile locked phone. But of course, that's not built into One UI 6.0. I mean, the change log is basically the change log that we've seen throughout. I didn't really see any new changes in One UI 6.0 stable rolling out on her T-Mobile model. Uh, I can't really say that the animations are a lot better than they are. She still uses the three button navigation instead of gestures. So it's kind of hard, I guess, to test them in the same way. But uh, I'm still running, by the way, for all of you who've been following the channel since I've been testing the beta. This is still my unlocked version. Uh, and my unlocked version is still running uh, ZWJM, which was the ninth beta edition of One UI 6.0. Uh, you can see this still has the October security patch. My last update was on October 25th, so over two weeks ago now. I really don't know why, but it's been the case in the last few years. I'll let you guys just compare the two update versions here. I don't really know why, but in the last uh, two years, Samsung has really made it such that the unlocked models in the US, particularly those that were running on the beta, end up getting the stable update last. Maybe they think it's because we already have a fairly stable update of One UI 6.0, uh, but it's very annoying because obviously if you have an unlocked phone, you're interested in getting the most recent software updates. So it looks like if you have an unlocked edition, particularly if you're already on the beta, you're probably going to get it last. T-Mobile got it. Uh, AT&T and Verizon will probably follow shortly after. I don't think I've seen anyone yet who had AT&T or Verizon say they've got this update. So if you have a locked uh, Verizon or AT&T model, let me know in the comments below. And of course, let me know as well if you have an unlocked model and you somehow received the update, but I haven't seen any indication of that from anyone just yet. Either way, it's really good news um, because we were waiting it on here in the US and everywhere else, well, not everywhere, Korea still hadn't got it either. But um, another thing too, my wife noticed is when you do download One UI 6.0, this is pretty common just to mention for other people who are not really you know, hardcore users. You might have a gap in your app drawer because some of the old apps were removed, like some of the old Galaxy apps, some of them were removed and replaced or renamed. Um, so you might see like a little hole in your app drawer. That's perfectly normal though. Uh, you can end up re, like rearranging the apps. Like you can do this. In fact, I'll do it for right now. You can change it to custom order and then change it back to alphabetical order and that fixes it. So I was gonna fix that for her anyway. So, cause it was really getting on her nerves anyway. One UI 6.0 stable rolling out in the US. Let me know if you guys got it yet. Not really a lot else to say about it. Of course, I'll have some more One UI 6.0 videos, especially as Samsung keeps updating good luck and all those apps for One UI 6.0. Check out the mystery boxes if you're gonna be ordering S24 stuff. 
pin comment description to sign up for that. We'll send out more information near to the launch. Appreciate you guys checking out the video and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.